He's actually sent me a few rings. I confirmed that it wasn't a real diamond, but it's still special because it comes from Post Malone. I've talked to him on the telephone three or four times. When we've talked, it's never his voice. He talks to me with a Jamaican accent to protect his identity. I have sent Post Malone around $3,000. It was just proof to his family that I was not using him for his money. I would send him a $50 gift card, a $100 gift card, maybe $150, but it was always for a good cause, supposedly. He would tell me it was for his charity. Everything about him makes him interesting to me. He is good looking and I do find his tattoos attractive. He calls me his queen, I call him my king. When we do text, Post will tell me I'm coming, my queen. And I say, okay, I'll see you when you get here. And he never does come. He tells me he's busy or he's got a concert. He always has an excuse. I know I'm not being scared. I've never met Post Malone, but I'm waiting for that day to come. That's why.